Johann Heinrich Friedrich Link, the 2nd of February 1767 to the 1st of January 1851, was a German naturalist and botanist. Biography. Link was born at Hildesheim as a son of the minister August Heinrich Link, 1738 to 1783, who taught him love of nature through collection of natural objects. He studied medicine and natural sciences at the Hanoversion Landesuniversität of Göttingen, and graduated as M.D. in 1789, promoting on his thesis, Flora der Felschestein rund um Göttingen, Flora of the Rocky Beds around Göttingen. One of his teachers was the famous natural scientist Johann Friedrich Blumenbach, 1752–1840. He became a private tutor private doesn't, in Göttingen. In 1792 he became the first professor of the new Department of Chemistry, Zoology and Botany at the University of Rostock. During his stay at Rostock, he became an early follower of the antiphlogistic theory of Lavoisier, teaching about the existence of oxygen instead of phlogiston. He was also a proponent of the attempts of Richter to involve mathematics in chemistry, introducing stoichiometry in his chemistry lessons. In 1806 he set up the first chemical laboratory at Rostock in the Seminargebaud. He began to write an abundant number of articles and books on the most different subjects, such as physics and chemistry, geology and mineralogy, botany and zoology, natural philosophy and ethics, prehistoric and early history. He was twice elected rector of the university. In 1793 he married Charlotte Julianne Josephie, 1768, minus 1829, sister of his colleague at the university professor. Wilhelm Josephie, 1763 1845. During 1797 to 1799, he visited Portugal with Count Johann Centurius Hoffmansig, a botanist, entomologist, and ornithologist from Dresden. This trip made him finally choose botany as his main scientific calling. In 1800, he was elected to the prestigious Leopoldina Academy, the oldest school for natural history in Europe. In 1808 he was awarded a prize at the Academy of St. Petersburg for his monographie von der Natur und den Eigenschaften des Lichts Nature and Characteristics of Light. His scientific reputation grew and became widely known. In 1811 he was appointed Professor of Chemistry and Botany at Breslau University, where he was equally elected twice rector of the university. After the death of Karl Ludwig Wildnau in 1815, he became professor of natural history, curator of the herbarium and director of the Botanic Garden Hortus Regius Barolinensis in Berlin until he died. This period became the most fruitful period of his academic life. He augmented the collection of the garden to 14,000 specimens, many of them rare plants. He worked in close collaboration with Christoph Friedrich Otto, 1783 to 1856, conservator at the Botanical Garden. In 1827, he named with him the cacti genera Echinocactus and Melocactus. Most of the fungi that he named are still recognized under the original name, proving the high quality of his work, such as Cordyceps, Creopus, Fusarium, Leocarpus, Myxomycetes, Framidium. He was elected member of the Berlin Academy of Science and many other scientific societies, including the Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences, which elected him a foreign member in 1840. He trained a whole new generation of natural scientists, such as Christian Gottfried Ehrenberg (1795–1876). Throughout his life, he traveled extensively throughout Europe. He benefited from his knowledge of foreign languages, including Arabic and ancient Sanskrit. He died in Berlin on 1 January 1851, almost 84 years old. He was succeeded by Alexander Heinrich Braun 1805 He is recognized as one of the last scientists of the 19th century with a universal knowledge. Link was also one of the few German botanists of his time, who aimed at a complete understanding of plants, through a systematic anatomical and physiological research. His most important work is the Handbuch zur Erkenning der Nutzbarsen und dem Hoffigsten Borkemenden Gewachsi, three volumes, published between 1829 and 1833. Selected works 
Grundlerin der Anatomy und Physiologie der Pflanzen, Göttingen, 1807, Fundamental Principles of the Anatomy and Physiology of Plants, proving for the first time that plant cells existed independently and were not part of a homogeneous vegetable mass. Nachtrage zu den Grundlerin etc., Göttingen, 1809, Supplement to the Fundamental Principles etc. Die er Welt und das Altertum, Erlauter, Dirch die Naderkunde, Berlin 1822–1822, 2nd ed., 1834, Prehistoric Times and Antiquity, Explained by Natural History Link, Johann Heinrich Friedrich 1829. Handbuch zur Erkening der Nutzbarsen und dem Hoffigsten Borkommenden Gewachse, in German. Berlin, Hod und Spenner. Retrieved 5 February 2015. Digital edition by the University and State Library Dusseldorf Erster Thiel 1829. Zweiter Thiel 1831. Dritter Thiel 1833. Das Altertum und der Übergang zur neuern Zeit Berlin 1842, Antiquity and the Transition to Modern Times Elementa Philosophiae Botanicae, Berlin 1824, 2nd ed., in Latin and German 1837 Anatomische Botanische Abbildungen zur Erlautering der Grundlerin der Krauterkunde, Berlin 1837–42, Anatomical Botanical Illustrations explaining the basic teachings for herbalists Ausgewalt Anatomisch Botanische Abbildungen, Berlin 1839–42, Selected Anatomical Botanical Illustrations Philicum Species in Horto Regio Barolinense Culte, Berlin 1841, Fern Species in Berlin Botanical Garden Anatomie der Pflanzen in Abbildungen, Berlin, 1843–47, Illustrated Anatomy of Plants He published together with Friedrich Otto, Icons Plantarum Selectarum Horti Regi Botanici Barolinensis, Berlin 1820-28, Illustrations of Selected Plants in Berlin Botanic Garden. He published with Christoph Friedrich Otto. This work was finished by the Friedrich Klotsch, 1841-1844, curator at the Botanical Museum. Icons Plantarum Rariorum Horti Regi Botanici Barolinensis, Berlin 1828-31, Illustrations of Rare Plants in the Berlin Botanic Garden He published together with Count von Hoffmannsig Flor Portuguese, Berlin. 1809-1840, Portuguese Flora, remaining a standard work for a long time. References External links Zoologica Gooding State and University Library